Alright, what's going on guys, it's Mr. Clash here, welcome back to another Clash of Clans gameplay commentary, and today we're going to be showing some epic, well, I'm going to be showing some epic loot rates from some of our members, so, uh, I think our member asked vid done random gamer, I'm actually recording right now, so, um, yesterday you guys did like my epic town hall 8's troll base, you guys really did enjoy this, so thank you to all of you that liked that video, really appreciate it. So the first replay is to be confirmed and looks like he found a dead base that has a ton of loot and I've lately I've been finding some okay loot not the best loot in crystal one it's like bases with like let's say 400,000 each and there's only like 30 or 40,000 um, or like 20,000 in the collector so it's not the best loot but I've been finding some decent loot and I've actually have not been finding a lot of Town Hall snipes up in Crystal 1, which is interesting, but I'll show you some of my raids. I actually did get some good loot raids, I think, yesterday, so... But anyway, to be confirmed, it's going to get some really good loot, and one of my other speed builds, I think it's a Town Hall 8 farming base. That thing is getting views like crazy every day, like, last week it was at 2,000 or something, now it's at almost 5,000, like 4,500 right now, so... That's pretty crazy, but anyway, to be confirmed, is going to get that loot, and looks like almost 200,000 of each, pretty much, 188,000 gold and 200,000 elixir, so a very good raid, but to be confirmed, um, that is some really, really good loot, and I'm actually really close of upgrading my cannon to level 12. I really want to upgrade this cannon to level 12, because I just want to max out my cannons, they are the cheapest compared to Archer Towers and other defenses, and they only take five days, which is not very much time. So let's replay. Um, now, Baller, I think this is the replay. No, this is not a giant. Okay, so earlier Baller got a different replay, but it looks like he, he did find more loot than he did his last replay. So let's check it out. He's attacking another base that has been inactive for quite some time because you guys can see... A lot of the collectors have full um, gold and elixir. That means the player is inactive. So we're going to speed this up a little bit. But carrying Barch, my favorite army, looks like Ball. I mean, yeah, Baller has two rage spells and one heal. I use I used to use heal spells with Barch as well uh, when I was actually practicing with Barch and stuff, just trying out different spells. And heal spell actually isn't too bad because if the collectors are in the inside in the gold mines are in the inside then just drop the heal spell on the barbarians and let the archers and all the other troops destroy so heal spells are actually not too bad so if you guys um, right now hearing me talk a little differently it's because my nose is stuffed up and I can't really hear myself um, super so I mean I can hear myself but I just my nose is stuffed up a little bit so I think yeah baller is gonna get this epic clutch two star uh, five seconds left and there we go nice two star by baller and that loot was really really good too so good job to be confirmed and baller for that amazing loot so let's go to our base and let's check out some loot so I can replay this one but I can replay this loot so I got a 69 percent two star and eight trophies I believe so this base wasn't like a dead base, but I did go because this was a Town Hall 8 with 500,000 loot almost. So, and this was really easy to get. And look at that. I destroyed the mortar and the wizard tower at the same time and the bottom mortar for only three spells. So that was awesome. Now, I dropped a couple barbarians because I was checking for giant bombs just in case there were um, giant bombs or spring traps because... You know, if you carry barge, uh, because a lot of our members carry barge, and if there's a giant bomb, a giant bomb can kill as many barbarians as, you know, the giant bomb's radius can explode. So, it can be very, very deadly to barge. Giant bombs, and even little bombs, because little bombs can add up, and they can destroy barbarians and archers especially. So, the level 12 king is amazing. Finally got my king in action. I'm going to be... Saving up some dark elixir try to upgrade him for see right there that giant bomb destroy quite a, a few of my archers But as I said of my king, I'm gonna save some dark elixir and it only costs 55,000 dark elixir to upgrade the barbarian king to level 13 So I'll be 
upgrading him to level 15 then I'll do queen to level 20 then I'll switch off every five levels so anyway the king is in the middle almost inside the core right well he is inside the core and looks like I will get that two star and I'm gonna use the king's ability in just a second so there we go I, I did use the ability and my queen's gonna just snipe the gold storage so there we go that was pretty good loot and I actually ended the raid there because it was pointless actually I did not go for 69% but it ended that way so and I did get eight trophies which helps because I've been actually dropping trophies lately because I have not been raiding a lot so I think somebody needs troops let me fill the story up real quick and I think I'm gonna replay one more uh, raid my latest one actually um, yeah this one even though it's not the best loot at all I mean it's just it's not even really that good of a loot but this was an awesome two-star raid so as always I have 110 barbarians and 110 archers as my typical barge strategy so I do have three spells my fourth spell had like a minute left so I didn't have four lightning spells here but finding these bases with not a lot of loot I still attack because I still can get some of the loot um, from the collectors and the gold mines so drop a couple barbarians and a couple archers there just to destroy the elixir collectors and I think the rest of my troops I'm gonna send down here I believe yeah or actually no right here because I needed that gold so I did drop the rest of my troops there um, my barbs and my archers so I'm gonna be dropping my heroes on the top corner right there and sometimes when I carry barge I click in the archers is um, by the clan castle and instead of clicking the archers I do click the clan castle it happens a lot to me I don't know if it happens to you or um, whoever carries barge you know if people carry barge uh, to me it happens so many times where I click archers and I place down but I click the clan castle troops so I, you know I waste the clan castle troops instead of archers and sometimes I really don't want to waste clan castle troops but it happens so just mistakes in clash of clans not that bad but my queen does get taken out by that king just slaps her and she gets knocked out so anyway my king is in action right there and luckily that archer tower after he destroys the x bow will stop shooting at him so we have 35 seconds left and only the mortars are doing the damage so the king is just hitting the town hall it's gonna take a while for him to get a town hall and luckily if i didn't use the ability the king would have died and i would have never got the town hall yeah, so even with my three lightning spells, I don't think I would have got the town hall without the ability. So the king is going to smash the dark elixir storage to get as much dark elixir as the king possibly can. And I got 500 dark elixir, not much. So that was just an average, I guess, raid. Not that big of loot. So anyway, I'm going to be saving up for this level 12 cannon. And I do have two builders open, so that's good. I'm going to save up for um, king to level 13. I can upgrade my uh, dark barracks to hounds but I already got hounds and hounds are amazing uh, I'll be definitely using those when I push so and I don't know if you guys seen in my other videos but I did upgrade hounds and I only have six days and three hours left till they're level two so that's awesome anyway hopefully all of you enjoyed this video I showed some epic loot raids from some of our members and a couple of raids from me anyway if we could smash 30 likes that'd be awesome as always I'll see you all of you on my next video